Kangaroos hopping into the wild world. G'day, nature enthusiasts. Welcome back to another thrilling episode of Wild Wonder, the animal podcast that takes you on an adventure through the fascinating world of wildlife. I'm your host, Blaze Wildlife, and today, we're bouncing into the wild outback of Australia to meet some of the most unique creatures on the planet kangaroos. Kangaroos are iconic marsupials known for their incredible hopping abilities and distinctive appearance. These remarkable animals have evolved to thrive in one of the harshest and most beautiful landscapes on Earth, the Australian outback. First things first, let's get to know these Aussie icons a bit better. Kangaroos come in four different species, the red kangaroo, eastern grey kangaroo, western grey kangaroo, and the antelopine kangaroo. Each one has its unique features, but they all share one common trait, those powerful hind legs built for hopping. Hopping is the primary mode of transportation for kangaroos, and they can reach speeds of up to 40 miles per hour. That's faster than many cars on the road. But how do they do it? It's all about their extraordinary leg muscles and tendons, which act like springs. This allows kangaroos to cover vast distances with minimal energy. Now, here's a fun fact for you. Did you know that kangaroos are the only large animals that use hopping as their primary means of movement? It's like they're nature's own pogo sticks. Kangaroos are marsupials, which means they give birth to relatively undeveloped young and carry them in a pouch. These baby kangaroos are called joeys, and the pouch provides a safe and cozy environment for them to grow and develop. A mother kangaroo can have multiple joeys at once. When a joey is born, it's about the size of a lima bean and completely helpless. It spends months growing and developing in its mother's pouch, eventually poking its head out to explore the world. Now, let's talk about what fuels these incredible hoppers. Kangaroos are herbivores, which means they feast on plants. Their diet mainly consists of grasses, leaves, and shrubs. Kangaroos have a unique digestive system that helps them break down tough plant material. They have a chambered stomach, similar to cows, that allows them to regurgitate and rechew their food, helping them extract maximum nutrients. Kangaroos are social creatures and often live in groups known as mobs or troops. These groups can range from just a few kangaroos to over a hundred. Living in a mob provides protection from predators and access to valuable resources like food and water. Kangaroos communicate with each other through a series of vocalizations and body language. You might hear them making clicking sounds, grunts, or even sneezing to signal their intentions to the group. While kangaroos are incredible survivors, they face several challenges today. Habitat loss due to agriculture and urban development, as well as climate change, pose significant threats to their populations. Additionally, kangaroos are sometimes culled in Australia due to concerns about overpopulation and damage to crops. Conservation efforts are crucial to ensure these unique marsupials continue to thrive in the wild. Well, folks, it's time to wrap up our kangaroo adventure. These remarkable marsupials are a true symbol of Australia's outback, and they deserve our admiration and protection. Remember, you can play a part in preserving kangaroos and their habitats. Support wildlife conservation organizations, spread awareness, and appreciate the natural wonders that surround us. Thanks for joining me on this thrilling episode of Wild Wonder. If you enjoyed our kangaroo journey, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this podcast. Together, we can ensure that the wild wonders of our planet continue to thrive. Until next time, stay wild, stay curious, and keep exploring the amazing world of animals. I'm Blaze Wildlife, signing off. Thanks for watching.